I am playing Lori Sullenberger, who is married to Sully Sullenberger, and she is uh, home in Danville, uh, California, when when this flight took off from LaGuardia and then ended up in the Hudson. So she had no idea it had happened until she received a phone call from her husband saying that he he wouldn't be there for dinner. <laughs> and it took her a while to sort of figure out what was going on. She, she learned very quickly, of course, because it was just all over the news and and their lives changed instantly. She was removed from, from all of it. So she was, you know, her contact with him was on the phone, um, which I can't imagine knowing that, you know, your spouse had been through something as, as unusual and traumatic as that, and now famous as that, um, and not being able to see them for several days until, until he was able to come home. So she's on the phone. Um, she gets his voice, and she gets to watch him on television, but that's about it. When, when someone is, as wonderful as Clint Eastwood asks you to be a part of something, and I've, I've been so fortunate to work with him a few times, you know, you just, you just jump in. You just know you're going to have a great time, that it's going to be interesting material, that you're going to be working with great people, that you'll be reunited with a crew who works so beautifully together and is so good to you while you're working. And, and you know, Clint creates an atmosphere quietly and elegantly that is, um, you know, it's just a joy. It's just, an, and you'll hear it over and over and over again. It's just, it's, it's heaven being on his sets. There's no one as, as big and as strong and as, who's held that capacity for so long and continues to do work on a, on a, on a very high level. And everyone still wants to work with him, everyone. <laughs> I don't know many people who've turned down a Clint Eastwood movie. It had to have been him. I don't know many other people who could have pulled that off, who could have executed that landing with, um, with such skill and with uh, such knowledge behind him, sort of guiding him and guiding his instincts. Um, you know, it wasn't instant pudding. It wasn't just a guy who was able to land a plane. This was a man who, who worked in love at, at aviation for decades, and it all paid off. It just all, it just is a good lesson, and if you work very hard, you know, a lot of things can happen.